Welcome back people, we're gonna continue Mighty number no. 9 here, this is Megafil X, let's go. We're going to the robot factory with Beck and Dr. White. This robot is uh, going crazy, producing crazy robots and we have to stop it. Yes, I know. Yes, this is the truth. This is a stage that requires you to use a lot of your reselection powers. And the song is nice. Now then, back. You needn't fight every robot you see. Our objective is the factory core. Let's go. So I'm gonna mostly use battalion again. Well, I say again, that's because it's very powerful. It's your best friend. Especially in this stage. The security system is scrambled. As it is, you must hit the panel there to open the door. It only remains open for each other, but that should pose no problem for you. Here you have to use Aviator to jump high enough to reach the ledge. And same here. It's nice because you see um, the other mighty numbers helping you. So here is a tricky part. You have to hold the button to hover down like that. Dash here. And we're clear. Switch to Brandish here. It's gonna be quite useful. Oh no, not sorry. It's gonna be again Battalion. Yes, you needed that. So I've got a refill now. I'm gonna try to not use it um, right away. Here we go. So you see, it's very uh, the level design is very calculated so that the bonuses you get from enemies, like here I got a bonus for powerful uh, attacks, it's really made for you to use it strategically right after you get it. Like now I've been able to take out the core by using that more powerful uh, bound, uh, missiles. See, like those those missiles are very powerful. You see the, the their explosion right now, but when you get the power uh, upgrade, the explosion is even bigger than that. <laughs> so yeah, this weapon is already very powerful, but when you when you get the red power up, it's even even more overpowered. Its only drawback here is pretty much that it's if the explosion uh, the explosion will knock out will knock out enemies that you might not want to knock out right away. So if you're going for a 100% uh, absorption rate, sometimes the explosion will take out enemies before you're actually close enough to them to absorb them. So that's that's a risk. So now we're gonna switch to Brandish. Take out this thing. Whoa. Oh yes, I managed to not get hit. When you play on the hard mode, those bombs actually home in on you. Crap. Crap. Let me just reload. Alright. I'm not used to dodging that attack where it, it sounds like a big laser all over the place because he, he never really lives long enough to do it. Whoa, 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 no, no, no. I'll be back. Hold on a second. Come on. Yeah.
There's a tricky thing with Beck is when he lands after a dash in the air, he will like stumble when he lands. So sometimes uh, it happened that to me that I got, I just fell off a platform because of that. So here you just have to take out a bunch of enemies and the tricky thing with this is that they're small and you don't see them because there's a lot of things going on. So even uh, after playing this part a lot I still mess it, mess it up here. But the good thing is that those little enemies are blue and they give you a lot of uh, blue energy. So you will eventually get a health refill. So the, 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 the levels are designed very much with that in mind. They will give you the tools you need to, to beat the levels. They will... Everyone's happy. They will give you the tools you need to get through. They will... The, the, the enemies have been placed according to how the level should be played. And um, I think level design is pretty good. So here you have a bunch of enemies like that that you can farm for energy if you want. Uh, I mean farm to get an L3 fill like I have right now. Okay, so the tricky thing here will be to dodge one of his attacks. Good heavens! I've never seen its like before. Has the factory started making its own designs? Beck, you must disable the computer core there before it can create an army of these. Nameless. So here is weakness is the uh, electricity, Dyna. So here we have to switch to... Actually I'm gonna switch to... Uh, di uh, I mean Cryosphere. See? It's very powerful against this boss. So what do you want to do here? So this is one of the tricky attacks to dodge. And uh, I just messed it up because you, you should not stand on the conveyor belt. Um, here you have to keep jumping and when you see a missile going on, on top of your head, you just go left or right and uh, I messed it up. So you use uh, Dynatron's power is against the eye here. You have to remain close to it. And I failed to dodge it. And uh, sorry, I messed it up completely. But it doesn't matter! Here you go. Come on. Step out. Now. Yeah. His arm is hard to dodge because you need to use Aviator to jump Laser. high enough to dodge Laser. it. And I'm still having trouble to, to switch to the correct form at the right time. Uh, if, any, if anything, one of the drawbacks to this game is that it's kind of hard to switch forms. Uh, when you're just experimenting. Excellent. That should halt the manufacturing of any more Berserker robots, at least. Good work, Beck. I'll meet you back outside the factory. There's someone I must see first. Doctor Wiley. I mean Blackwell. Um, hello, Doctor Blackwell. One of those Sanders, aren't you? The scientist one. What do you want? 
Do you know what's going on outside? The crazy robots, the, the clashes, the, the chaos? I am aware. What did that twin Graham expect activating her again? Again? <clears throat> Graham? From Cherry Dynamics? What do you mean, activating her again? Oh, gasp, but Trinity, of course. Time. And what thanks did I get? Lifetime stay at this maximum security resort. She's in rice! <laughs> you mean the cyber terrorism attack you were arrested for was was to stop Graham? Trinity can assimilate any robot's programming and overwrite it. Take control of it. And not just the programming. She can incorporate a bot's components. Expanding herself endlessly. <gasps> if she's been activated, it's already too late. Trinity cannot be stopped. Oh, oh, peas and carrots. Peas and carrots, cheese and rice. <laughs> Are these actual like curse words? Like, I do actual Dr. expressions in English. Stop you this time, yet you're scapegoating him again, just the same. It was never about progress with you. Just money. Always money. No, 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 this isn't my fault. Her warning label didn't mention all this. I mean, not specifically. I blame her creators. I blame the shareholders. I blame corporate society. I blame my parents. <laughs> Trinity was my experiment. She was ultimately deemed a failure, but she was an educational one. I put everything I learned from creating her into Mighty Number no. 9. Beck is our only hope of stopping her. Wait, 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 wait a minute. I didn't recognize you with that ridiculous hairdo, but you're Bill Blackwell! No, my name is William White. I'm not Bill Blackwell. And I haven't been for a long time. Hmm. All right, quit your lollygagging. It's up to us to stop those rampaging bots. So now this is the final stage. We're going to be back in the next part to play this stage. See you there.